Well, tonight, INDOT is focusing on improving passenger rail service for part of the state. CBS 4's Hannah Adamson reports now others pushing for expansion say the state really isn't going far enough. As the Federal Railway Administration and Amtrak hammer out their plans to expand passenger service, some industry experts say Indiana is lagging behind neighboring states in doing the same. Indiana seems to be the state that is doing the least right now. Stephen Coxhead with the Midwest Interstate Passenger Rail Commission says Indiana has only requested federal funding to boost service between Indianapolis and Chicago leaving individual cities to make their own requests. The uh, Fort Wayne Regional Planning uh, Organization has requested uh, funding for a Chicago, Fort Wayne, Lima, Ohio, Columbus, Ohio uh, corridor. The uh, city of Louisville has requested corridor ID funding for Louisville to, uh, Louisville to Indianapolis. INDOT says it's keeping its focus on the Indianapolis-Chicago corridor due to staffing and resources. The department says it applied for a $500,000 federal grant to help create a strategic plan. Track improvements, facility improvements, operating costs, ridership statistics. Um, we'd be looking at all of those things, you know, to see what's feasible. Garrett says the department will know by the end of this year if they will receive the grant. Right now, there is no timeline for implementation. In addition to expansion efforts, Coxhead says INDOT and Amtrak are working to solve an ongoing congestion issue for passenger trains going through northern Indiana. It's known as the South of the Lake reroute. So that, that is just discussion so far, but at least it is moving forward. Reporting in Indianapolis, Hannah Adamson, CBS 4 News.